बिकॉज वी हैव सीन लॉर्ड ऑफ महाराष्ट्र पुलिस और इवन मुंबई पुलिस बीन कंपेयर्ड विद इंटरनेशनल स्टैंडर्ड सर सो डू यू थिंक देर इज सम इंटरनेशनल स्टैंडर्ड दैट यू हैव ब्रॉट इन टू पुलिस फंक्शनिंग दैट इज नीडेड येस डेफिनेटली बिकॉज वेन इंटरनेशनल स्टैंडर्ड इफ यू सी इन फॉरन कंट्रीज वेरी फ्यू पीपल गो टू इन्वेस्टिगेट केसेस hardly 4% cases are taken up here if it is a cognizable office it is taken up parties you must have seen the news and the views that we go from kashmir to kanyakumari all over place during corona also yeah. to catch hold of victims and i can tell you indian police is better hmm. better than all international polices they may be having fancy gadget they may be having a lot of tech support but uh, gut feeling and sheer hard work nobody can match indian police So in police department you yourself have been into 3 decades of service sir so you have seen lot of lifestyles so one one side there is a rural area uh, then we have tribals are there urban cosmopolitan creamy layers people are there so uh, there is lot of manpower crisis all together in home ministry always a question has been asked around police department and how many recruitments need to be there and at the same time handling the police people handling law and order situation covid crisis women's issue child issues are there everything people like they don't think even if for a small issue they call up 100 number vip bandobast is there filing charge sheets are there so police plays a vital role into different different they are a multitasker i i believe so so what according to you think that you know uh, the work should be segregated there has been attempt to segregate law and order and crime not very successful but traffic is almost segregated cyber is almost segregated economic offense is almost segregated but law and order and crime is still mixed up at the police station level there has been various attempt but uh, in future but ha huh, specialized units have come all over places you have ats to deal with terror attack then you have a uh, commandos to deal with the like force one to fear uh, terror attack as such prevention that is for investigation then you have srpf so some some specialization forces are coming there is a segregation and uh, as uh, as you rightly said if you want to have expertise you have to segregate and training has to role to play so it is the effort is going on and limited manpower whatever best the police is doing sir few personal questions sir sir you have been an I- iitn from kanpur sir and a btech uh, itself sir and have what prompted you to come to police department and being an iitn sir we have seen where, where are today iitn sir do you think that you are very happy no no i am very happy and it is not like that ki when we came into services in 92 it was a trend maybe 80s it was not but 80 early 80s 82 83 onwards in the batch of of 80 uh, my batch was six, uh, 78 something uh, 56 were engineers and 45 were from iit so that trend has come maybe the lure of uh, powerful position they drove the engineers to this position this area and uh, civil services if you see the intake is hardly 100 to 150 mm-hmm. iit in right now it is 5000 mm-hmm. more than 5000 in fact it is touching 10000 so competition is here is different people want to be there and there's nothing like that you are downgraded while going to college so but what prompted you when i passed out i had a scholarship and i was into my whether to go to pursue my further studies in usa or not and then that time in india not good opportunities were there in this uh, private sector and government opening was the best opening still it is the best opening but there are certain comparable jobs in private sector that time it was zero so whoever wanted to stay in india and want to be in good job civil services there was one of the option and that is why i took it up and i wrote the civil services so uh, you yourself is a family man and a parent all together two children are into iit and already and uh, so being even when it comes to serving for a citizen sir it's duty first and that is also one family important family then your own personal family sir so when you are stepping inside the home how are you and sir uh, when it comes to even uh, role of a father sir have you taken up studies of your children and how are you as a father sir let me put it like that no wife is satisfied by the uh, any person who has uh, done the role of father but some of my wife is happy <laughs> about that uh, my both the kids are in iit 
my elder son he did btech from iit bombay and then right now he's i am calcutta my younger daughter he sees from iit kharagpur she has been selected for i am also i am calcutta and she has got from london business school also so that way i have been god has been very kind to us yes uh, kids good kids and studies doesn't happen automatically whoever claims that is wrong and uh, at appropriate mem- moments when my kids were at 11 12th i took s- something like a some non desirable posting as you said non executive side posting so that more time is there and i can devote with my kids family today also one tries to be and claims to be family man i try to be a family man so try to keep parents kids and wife happy pa- kids during corona stayed with us otherwise from 16 we have not seen the kids both were at iits but uh, god has been kind in overall situation so now you yourself mentioned that wife is never happy or like most of the time so according to you i'll pitch in other way sir according to you being a good husband or good parent plays a vital role for you uh, my wife claims that i am a good parent beyond that she doesn't comment so i don't want to comment on anything else because uh, maybe time is the crisis and, but we have a good family life so god matlab maybe my kids have done exceedingly well so no no calm about that and we have been together we have grown all four of us all six of us my parents stays with me six of us for last 20 years we have grown together so good so sir is a family man all together we have come to know sir today youngsters are drove to lot of uh, social elements we have seen real making most of them drawn to work criminal mentality then accepting them as in khaki uniform what do you think uh, for them any message for them don't uh, get uh, lured by shortcuts so you must have seen there can be shortcuts some shortcuts at the root but the, your life cannot be shortcut some tra- people try to make the whole life as a shortcut there you trip so don't go to crime things shortcut means you you have a better idea you have a better strategy you may be falling somewhere like a, some skills or social skill or emotional skill you upgrade those skills and then your that is a shortcut but don't go for a crime because it doesn't pay in long run sir you have been an iit and sir you mentioned and you have used you have also stressed in your dip, uh, in working functioning most of technology sir sir any time academics have helpful for you sir i don't know my btech has helped but yes iit give you a different mindset the rational mindset the tongue, tongue in cheek approach the being uh, from lower middle class you have a humble background i keep try to keep that background in front of me i know i know i am on this side of the table but all my relatives all my family is that side of the table so i have to think not for me for all of them together so that approach i have kept it like that so education as such or learning as such or from the life that is more important thank you sir sir uh, apart from police and we have seen you read lot of books and you are a good orator itself sir so we would like to know what are your hobbies and how do you still uh, root for it sir hobbies uh, reading i don't get much time i used to be but yes sports i do previously i used to sp- play team sports but now it becomes a crisis of management because if you play tennis you have to have three more men then there is a rotation on the tennis court so then i have shifted to the individual game like running gym you can do on your own come at your own time go then yoga i do yoga a lot of i go trekking also and then swimming these are the things i have stressed and sometime if i get a chance we have a team sports on sunday with our own staff so currently uh, in the current situation sir we have seen you have handled one of the most difficult aspects of recruitment sir because this is going on from long and when we saw the investigation also we have uh, we have seen that you know it has been into uh, because lot of people have been con and under the name of recruitment people are taking money so what prompted you to take this tack and how difficult was it because i know that there could be a political as well as defense also recruitment was one thing that because it, there was a, another department which also was dealing with it so, so uh, i think the people have more faith in pune police so they the students the organization the ngos they were giving me lot of clues so and maybe they were giving these clues to many people but our own cyber police station or uw crime branch both the dcps bhagshi and sinovas 
they put their heart and soul and then they try to work it out and all the leads were taken to logical conclusion it is never ending because if you see the magnitude as you go deep it gets expanded mm. so i don't know whether we will be reaching till the end because everybody will be different look differently but we are trying to travel as far as possible with all the scandals which we have unearthed so for you uh, rehabilitation is plays a vital role or penalizing the accused depends upon the accused type of case if there are citizen teenager youngster we try to counsel we don't want to have the record because everybody has gone through that age and you must have seen we have never done any raids on a hotel where we have humiliated people or rape party we have prevented it in self in fact we never try to arrest those people also hmm. make cases because then they have a scar on their mind and then future is spoiled and then they struggle with that thing so we don't want to do that but hmm. second criminals we are very clear okay put them behind bar so uh, you have served in enormous posting in maharashtra so we have seen in your cv itself like it was four to five pages and we have seen that you know one episode will go into reading your entire cv so which another task that you want to take after as a chief of pune city commissioner very difficult question so it is not in my hand it's actually in government hand so whatever they give i would like to do uh, some unfinished agendas are there like i was part of the ats team so uh, when uh, train blast took in 2006 so ats is one of the thing which uh, which is there but it is up to government to see the suitability for the person in which job he fits more and then take decision accordingly so for police own department what is the effective measures that you take for your own manpower keeping them happy is the first thing because uh, normally the uh, the hierarchy in police is that ki whatever you make their life miserable then only they work this is the standard practice which our sub culture has i have uh, thought and i am dealing upside down actually my many approach are out of box thinking and this approach is also out of box I never disbelieve my subordinate I give them full freedom I keep them happy and just seeing my face they don't want me to be unhappy and so they deliver every investigation every detail every criminals whatever I my wish they they, they put it heart and soul to get it done any message that you would like to give our viewers sir uh, it has been a roller coaster journey for last uh, 15 months in pune lot of love affection from public from leadership from my own people from my own subordinate and please continue this love for till i am here thank you sir thank you very much sir for giving us time sir i'm thankful for you thank you all viewers for listening me out if you have listened me